When he gets on stage, the crowd goes wild. El Comandar is among Mexico's most popular performers of narco corridos. He sings about cattle wars, women and alcohol, and invites the audience to drink with him. He's so handsome, I love him. I think he talks about what concerns us as Mexicans. Sure, his songs are about drugs, but you don't need to take them to like his music. His graphic songs and music videos have turned him into an outcast of the music industry. His albums are shunned by music labels and radio stations. El Comandar was even banned from performing in a city south of Mexico's capital after being accused of promoting violence. My job is to sing. I sing my music, I'm happy and I'm doing very well. So they stopped us from going to Cuernavaca. Well, we won't go, what's the big deal? When he sings, his bodyguards don't leave his side. Singing narco corridos can be dangerous. Some 50 performers have been murdered in Mexico since drug-related violence surged in 2006, forcing artists to tone down their lyrics. El Commander, El, Commander, RS. El Commander is a regional Mexican music. Sadly, they've started to call it the agitated movement. They've started to single it out in a bad way. But many Mexicans don't see any harm in taking a break from their country's problems and joining El Commander for a dance. <laughs>